But then you get on, you put your mask on, you get on the subway. So, <laughs> I put this shirt on. Maybe that's why. What do you do? Do you do this? Nope. And I get on the subway and everything's fine and no one cares. And people are, there's a family of four with their kids wearing masks. You can tell their tourists are taking pictures right next to me. They don't care. They're living their dream. So I'm like, so now I'm like, uh, I want a fucking cold brew coffee. That'll relax me. So I fucking, and I'm still fucked up and there's a late, so I fucking, uh, Order it on the app from, now normally I go, I go, here's my stop. I go 96, 86, 72nd, 63rd, 57th, 42nd is where I order it. And then you get to 34th and you walk in and get it, right? I'm like, it was busy last time. Let me order a simple cold brew black coffee. I order it at 63rd. Four stops I give. Four fucking stops. You're talking 16, 18 minutes. At least 10 solid minutes. I walk into the Starbucks downstairs. Did you fuck the fan there? No, 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 I didn't even get to the fan yet. I walk into the Starbucks like this, no mask, with my headset on, and and the guy, I guess this is the same. Are you sure he was a guy? Because we talked to someone that we thought was a guy for a couple days. It was a girl. This he was he, he I think he was born, he was a biological male, but he lives like a bitch. So I walk in, and it might have been the same black guy that last time I said, hey, thanks, and ignored him and walked out. I walk in, my black coffee is not ready. Okay, so I'm all, now I'm doubly aggravated as I have been from the get-go. In fact, you could hear a cute story about it. So you go it. up to look and it's not there. That's not how there. you pick these orders up. You yeah. go and look, was there other ones there? There were three there and they were all- Did you turn them around with no, your you, hand because, like annoying people do when oh, they go- I should have, but none of them looked like mine because they're all faggoty drinks, you yeah. know? So, and if you wanna hear more about these stories, go to Uncle Gino is Amazing and go to the track called uh, Starbucks. Now, anyway, so now I'm livid about that. I'm livid that 20 minutes fucking, 10 to 50 minutes leeway isn't enough to pour Pour a black coffee without anything in it, right? So now I'm mad. And the guy goes, and the guy, you could tell he's so fucking, it's like he he can't ask if I'm vaccinated or not, and I don't have a mask on. He's like, you gotta, you gotta sit down if you're, and then he starts yelling. I'm like, what? And he's yelling at the guy behind me. Why? Because the other guy is got the mask down. He's like, you gotta stay six feet away if you're in here. And I went like this. I went like this. I'm like, this is sad. This is sad. And I stormed out, and it felt so good. And then you know what everyone did? Way to go, man. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. They can take our cold. Oh. They can take our cold brew, but they can't take our freedom. I swear, to, I will allow this. I will allow this. And that's how good it felt. And this will keep going on. This will keep going on. Because fucking people. And then I get off the subway, and Aaron, oh! thank, you, thank you, thank you, thank you. We're all heroes today. We're all heroes. We're all heroes. So then I walk in. Steve, go find me a picture of a dick and a fan. Thank you. All right. Okay. So we really just don't want to work today? Is that it? Do we really not just want to? Look, I'm not going to stop you. I'm not going to stop you. All right, cheers, thank you. Yes, All thank right. you, yes! Like you got to tip your cap, you got to tip your cap, thank you. All right, all right, there you go, there you go. You can go till your hands hurt. It's been a long fucking week. Went and got a juice. Oh. It felt that fucking good. It did. You wanna put your dick in the I'm not putting my dick in the fan, Steve. And no one can see you because you're not in the boat to point it at you. Shit. I'm not kidding. It felt that good, but that's gonna keep going on. And and you're gonna do that every day in the Starbucks. I I gotta go back to that Starbucks. So now me. you paid for coffee you didn't get. Oh, that's what else I said. I said you can keep my because the guy looked at me. He's like, "What did you order?" Not now, not now. I'll tell you. Let me finish real fast. He goes, "What?" Did, no, I'll tell you what. He goes, "What did you?" <laughs> he said, "What did you order?" Because he wanted to get me out of there. Because that was what I left out. You know what? The story's over. The story's over because we have other show to get to. Then what happened? I, I I said you can keep the coffee. I swear to God, I yelled that. Don't come on. Don't. No, that's
felt good. So, I'm, so I paid $4.29 for a venti cold brew, and I didn't even pick it up. 